Welcome back to Televa News at Noon. Joining me now is Matt Machero from the Capital Humane Society who has brought in Coconut. Yes. Maybe one of the smallest uh, dogs we've had. One of the smallest dogs we've probably ever yeah. had on here. So, exactly. yeah. So, Coconut's about six months old. He's a Chihuahua mix, neutered male, and he weighs just over three pounds. And okay. so, at six months old, he is definitely not going to get a whole lot bigger. So, he's definitely going to be a very small, kind of like a teacup uh, sort of dog. And mm -hmm. so, as you can see, he's very much a lap dog and uh, the sort of dog that can go just about anywhere with you. So maybe you want to adopt him, Brad. You can get a little satchel thing that, and he can right. go around all over with you. <laughs> and, and, uh, <laughs> but a uh, super sweet puppy and he ended up at the shelter as a lost dog earlier this month. Oh. And surprisingly, nobody came looking for him and he got adopted, mm -hmm. but it didn't work out. Uh, the folks that adopted him did everything right, but uh, there are two cats at home just were not ready to have a uh, puppy as a, as a brother and uh, they didn't want to eat anymore and they didn't want to use their litter box anymore. So wow. we do not fault them for how running. So, how can something so small be so <laughs> disruptive to yes, big cats, right? Yes. <laughs> so, uh, you know, he's very playful and he's done well with other dogs, you know, his size. And so I think he would, would do well in a home with other dogs and cats that want to have a uh, canine brother, but uh, smaller children might be a little too much for him just given his size and, right. you know, he's a little, Petite, and petite, small dog, and so he's been neutered, he's been microchipped, he's got his vaccinations taken care of, and so uh, he's actually very well behaved for okay. being six, six uh, months old and uh, still need to work on the house training and the basic obedience, right. but well-behaved puppy. Okay, just real quick, you have a lot of dogs and cats, right? Yeah, so lots of dogs, lots of cats. We have more dogs than we have kennels available at the adoption center, so some okay. of those dogs are available for adoption by appointment at our admission center, so check out our website, capitalhumanesite.org. All right, thank you, Matt. We'll be right back.